Hey, guys. Hey. So I came into San Francisco ready and eager to learn more about myself. I had three main goals for this uh, phase of my gap year. To strengthen my public speaking skills, to become more independent, and to gain more self-confidence. I can say that this phase of my gap year has been a rough sail due to some personal issues I had, but this has also been a life-changing experience. I gained a better understanding of what I'm capable of, what I can overcome, and ultimately more self-confidence. I like to call these first two weeks of my program the calm before the storm. This was the time where I explored the city. I was learning great things, and I was, and I was visiting national parks. I gained a great experience by going to these national parks, and it really brought me alive. <laughs> I made some, I was getting along with most people here in a more quiet, introverted way, and that's what I was comfortable doing. <laughs> I could say that I gained a lot of independence because at home, I was used to doing things with my parents a lot. Here, I decided to challenge myself and to go out and do things on my own and become more independent. I realized that I accomplished this goal and I feel very proud of myself for doing this. <laughs> I had my first presentation and I was really eager to keep trying at presentations. With each presentation I did, I strengthened my skills even more. <laughs> I like to call the next eight weeks the hurricane. When I first came in, oh, um, so I realized that when I first, I tried to get to know a lot of people here and I feel like I was shut out and excluded a bit. So I found refuge in the eye of the storm, getting to know a few nice people who included me and also persevering and focusing on my presentation skills. I really want to credit these people who included me because not everyone has the courage and the guts to reach out to someone on the outside. So I want to give a special thank you to those people. I felt very strong because I could persevere through this tough situation and I felt like after doing this I could tackle the world and do whatever I want to set my mind to. This gave me a huge confidence boost and I'm really proud of myself for getting through this phase. Last part is the peaceful end. So I applied for an amazing internship in Bekwa, Fiji, where I'll be studying marine conservation and learning how to become a dive master. <laughs> this is a perfect internship for me because this has been my passion ever since I was a kid. I used my new, I, I applied my skills and newfound knowledge to get this in internship and I had a perfect interview. I can definitely say I'm proud of myself for doing this and I could say that I accomplished all three of my goals that I set in the beginning. Thank you for listening to my story.